It is a national institution. However, after recent rule changes, the Grand National may not remain the same for much longer. The British Horse Racing Authority and Aim2 Racecourse have announced several changes to the race after calls from animal rights groups to further protect the welfare of the horses. The main difference will see the start move forward by 90 yards, away from the grandstand and some 70,000 people in attendance. This will therefore reduce the race distance to 4 miles 3.5 furlongs. Other changes include the widening of the no-go zone for jockeys from 15 yards to 30. However, the key issue is that both Beaches Brook and the field size of 40 runners will remain the same for next year's renewal something which has caused concern for animal rights groups such as the RSPCA. Cali Ridings, senior press officer of the RSPCA, said the organisation was cautiously welcoming of the changes, stating that any improvement in the welfare of the horses was progress. However, she warned that it would be the last chance of the VHA to prove that Beaches Brook was a safe and fair test for the horses. The changes have arisen after two horses were killed in this year's race. Runners according to Pete and pre-race favourite Synchronised, ridden by Tony McCoy, both obtained fatal injuries as a result of falling at the beach of Buck Friends, leading to further calls to abolish it completely. Owner Trevor Hemming's stables in Exton, Lancashire, have seen great success in recent years, housing two winners in the previous five renewals. His racing manager, Mick Neger, feels the changes have gone far enough. I think they might have picked on, picked on Beatrice Brook because that on last year that was unfortunately the fence where there were a few incidents. I mean, um, again, Beatrice Brook is part of, of, of the race and that's the, the, the difficulty of the race, which again makes it what it is, you know. Um, you take away Beatrice Brook, you take away from the race. Beatrice Brook will feature next year, but it remains to be seen how much longer. Nick Seddon, Jamie Journalism, Aintree.